In this video, we will learn about pointers. A pointer is a variable that stores the memory address of another variable. Before we learn about pointers, let's take a look at how we can obtain the memory address that a variable is stored at. We'll create an int variable named i, assigned an initial value of 3. Then we will output ampersand i to the console. When we run the code, notice that its memory address is printed out. It will almost certainly be different than the one you see on my screen, and if you run the code multiple times you will get a different address each time. Don't worry, this is normal. As I mentioned, a pointer is a variable that stores the memory address of another variable in the C++ program. Up at the top of the code, let's include the string header file. Let's create a string variable named s that we assign a value of the string abc. Then we will type string, then an asterisk, and then the name of the variable, which we will call pointer, and set it equal to ampersand s. Finally, we will output pointer to the console. When we run the code, notice that the memory address being stored by the variable was output to the console. Let's break down the syntax of creating a pointer. The pointer needs to have the same type as the variable it is pointing to. Then comes an asterisk, the name of the pointer, and then we set it equal to ampersand, and then the name of the variable of interest. The recommended syntax for a pointer is to have the asterisk immediately after the type, but it is also valid to have it before the variable name, or in between the type and variable name. All of these ways are valid, but the first way we looked at is the recommended approach. Mm -hmm. 